Hi everyone, this is Heather from the Flourish Academy, where our goal is to empower, educate, and elevate you to create a life that you love through the art and business of photography. Doesn't that sound lovely? Make sure you join us in our free private Facebook group in order to learn more. In this video, we're going to create a new catalog inside of Lightroom, but first, make sure you check out all of the free resources available on our site. I've shared my file structure in the past, but if you're not familiar with it, what I do is every year I create a high level folder for that particular year that contains folders for my clients and my personal as seen here. And if you drill down inside of these folders, you'll notice that they're organized by month. If you'd like to get a more detailed look at my workflow, I have a free video series available. The link is below. But as part of that workflow, I create two new Lightroom catalogs per year, one for clients and one for personal. So I'm gonna jump over to Lightroom and in order to create a new catalog, I'm going to go to the file menu and choose new catalog. Lightroom is essentially asking me two questions at this point. What do you wanna name it and where do you wanna save it? I'm going to begin by creating my client catalog. And because I'm very creative, I named it 2017 clients. <laughs> and that's just because I don't want any room for error. This is the name of my catalog for the year. I'm going to place it inside of the folder that contains all of my images for that year. When I click create, Lightroom is going to create a new folder inside of this set. It's going to close my current catalog and launch the new one. Because I have my preferences set up to ask me to back up the catalog when Lightroom exits, I have to address this, but I didn't make any changes in this catalog, so I'm just going to skip. And now we have a nice, clean, fresh catalog for 2017 clients. Let's go ahead and repeat that process for my 2017 personal images. Again, file, new catalog. Lightroom wants to know what do you want to name this and where do you want to put it. So let's name this catalog 2017 personal, but let's make sure we put it in the appropriate folder and go ahead and say create. I want to jump over to finder so that I can show you what this looks like. If I drill down into my 2017 clients, you'll see that there is another folder named 2017 clients and that's just where my catalog lives. Why do I create new catalogs every year? It's just to keep them neat and streamlined. It doesn't really matter if you have a catalog. If you create a catalog and you store years worth of photos in that catalog, that's really not a problem unless it gets too large and starts to slow down. This is just my personal preference. And speaking of preferences, because I'm a catalog jumper, that is from day to day, I could be working on a variety of photos. I have my preferences set up so that Lightroom asks me which catalog I would like it to open when I launch. In order to access the preferences, press command comma on the Mac, that's control comma on the PC. And in the general tab, you'll see when starting up, use this catalog. I have a lot of catalogs that I work on, but I want Lightroom to prompt me so that when I launch it, I just choose the catalog that I will be working on at that particular time. Again, if you would like a more detailed explanation, including printables, showcasing my workflow, you can do so via the link below. I hope that you found this useful.